on today, we remember that Jesus climbed up a mountain with Peter and James and John, and on top of that mountain, some kind of mystical experience happened that is, defies all explanation. Jesus was surrounded by a cloud, and out of that cloud, the disciples saw Elijah and Moses standing on either side of him, and he was talking to them. This tells us that God transcends time, which means that God is talking to the people that you love who have died, even right now. And Peter, in all of his exuberance at this incredible revelation, says, wow, this is a Kodak moment. Why don't we build three little booths and we'll all stay right here because this is great and it feels wonderful. That's what we're always trying to do, capture the moment with our cell phones, with our video recorders, make it stop, make the good things stop and hold still. But nothing ever does. And it wasn't God's will for that moment to be held. It was God's will for that moment to be experienced, to be heard, to be absorbed. When something beautiful happens in your life, sure, you can take pictures, but don't be afraid to just be present. That moment will never be replicated. Nothing can ever preserve it exactly the way it is right now. So just breathe and give thanks for whatever it is that God is revealing to you. And remember that we cannot hold on to God.